the members of parliament, Sejirinya and Sewanyana, were forced to confess that His Excellency Robert Chagulani, also known as Bobby Wine, planned massacre killings. Hello, welcome, and thanks for taking your time joining us live on Projan Media TV. That brings the latest news and the latest updates in the country and across the world. It may be your first time to be on this platform, but kindly do one thing. Subscribe, turn on the notification button. All these top stories will come to you in time. But let's take more look into some of these details. Uh, the members of parliament have been left shocked after revelations that matching the member of parliament, Honorable Alan Sewanyana and his Kawempe North counterpart, Muhammad Sejirinya, were forced to make false confessions. The pair were arrested and detained after they were implicated in the recent machete mothers in the Masaka sub-region and we are subsequently charged and they were subsequently charged with murder attempt and treason and aiding and abetting terrorism. Now after MP Muhammad Sejirinya got hospitalized at Mulago Hospital, he was visited by fellow members of parliament who include Honorable Francis Zake, Mathia Simpuga, Sewungu Gonzaga, Joyce Bagala, and among others. From their interaction with the Sejirinya, they learned of the shocking ordeal the two legislators were subjected to in jail. The legislator confessed to his comrades that he was injected with mysterious substances, with the recent ones causing him to black out. He also revealed that the rotting foot was actually out of torture. However, what shocked the legislators most of that Sejirinya intimated to them that they were forced to make confessions incriminating National Unit Platform Supreme Robert Chagulani Center, also known as Bobby Wine, as the mastermind behind the massacre murders. It should be remembered that Sejirinya and Sewanyana have been denied bail on several occasions ever since they were rearrested outside Chigo prison and since then their legal team has been tolling to secure temporary freedom for the legislators but all in vain. As we're talking now they are still under custody and the police and the court has never given them bail. He is just in Mulago hospital due to the hospital and critical condition he is in. Though according to him in the hospital he said the police forced them to confess that Bobby Wine was the master planner behind all the massacre killings. Yeah. Uh, well, that is it for now and thanks for watching Projan Media TV. We'll keep on updating with more of this. Just kindly do one thing. Subscribe and tap on the notification button. All of these top stories will be coming to you in time. Once again, thanks for watching Projan Media TV.